So we are here in my room. Gray's watching a show on YouTube. And I actually got out all of my old maternity clothes and I'm going through them to see what I can wear this year and what I need to put back. Um, this is the pile that I probably won't use. Like this, these are holiday themed that I won't be pregnant. So I had a turkey, uh, Thanksgiving one with a turkey. I had a Halloween one with a pumpkin on it. Um, this one is, uh, this says bun in the oven. Anthony and I, for Halloween, I went as the oven with a bun and Anthony was a chef. And then a, um, snowman. So all of these will not work this pregnancy because I won't be pregnant during those months. So I'm already putting those back. These are black pants. I use them for work every day, but I don't work anymore. I stay home with Gray. So I don't think I'll need those anymore. And then I do have this sweatshirt, which I did wear a lot, but I just feel like by the time, like my sweatshirt still fit me. It's really just the pants that don't fit me right now. So I feel like maybe I won't need that. I don't know if I should keep it out or not. Maybe I'll just keep it out just in case a chilly day comes when I'm bigger. But here's what I have right now. I actually do have two pairs of shorts, even though I really wasn't pregnant in the summer last time. We went on a trip to Miami when I was like five months pregnant, six months pregnant. So those will come into great use. I have a lot of like, these are all long sleeve shirts. These are all quarter sleeve shirts. Um, and then I have jeans. And then this is a really nice um, tank top, which will be super nice because I will need a lot of tank tops and then I do have like stretchy um stretchy pants just like sweatpants so those will be nice too but I need a lot more short sleeve shirts I did get a few um from the mo the mother her maternity store because it was closing so this shirt I love it it says due in September, which I am due in September. So that's one short sleeve shirt that I have. <laughs> um, I got this dress, which I don't have any dresses. Actually, that's not true. I have this dress and then I haven't opened it yet, but I got a like a nicer dress to wear to probably my sister's rehearsal dinner in June when I'll be super pregnant. So, yeah, I got another cute dress. We're going to be going on a couple of vacations this summer. Um, we're going to be going to um, Pigeon Forge in July. We're going to be going to, uh, I'm going to be going to Miami uh, for the bachelorette party. Um, and I am going to be going to, uh, Anthony and I are going to um, Seattle in May. I don't think I'll need any like dresses or probably not a lot of shorts in Seattle in May because it'll probably still be kind of cold but definitely Miami I'll need shorts and dresses because we're going to go out at night and stuff and then definitely Pigeon Forge in July it's going to be hot. So another thing I need to get is a maternity bathing suit. I don't have any. Um, Last year I just wore a bikini and I just like stretched it out, but I don't think that's gonna work this year because I just have more. <laughs> so I'm gonna get a maternity like one piece bathing suit. I think it'll look super cute. So I need to look. If you guys know of any cute like maternity bathing suit stores, let me know. Put a comment down. What do you want? One more time. He's been saying one more time and again. Felix is supervising. I got this. You want the music on? So yeah, I'm working on all the clothes, organizing. I don't know where I'm gonna put all these clothes. It's it's a lot. So I don't think I mentioned earlier, but I was get the reason I was getting all of my maternity clothes out is because my belly keeps getting bigger and pretty soon I'm not going to be able to fit into my jeans. It's not, like I was saying earlier, it's not so much the shirts that are having the problem, it's the jeans. My jeans are 
for regular me and my belly is already pushing at the button and the button is like straining like I'm not gonna be able to fit much longer so I had to get out all my maternity clothes and they were put away in the basement so I just got everything out I was looking at everything and I don't have like any short sleeve shirts but a lot of my short sleeve shirts are more baggy so it probably could fit my belly a little bit longer but I'm definitely gonna need some as the summer goes on. We have been listening. His favorite songs right now are Row, Row, Row Your Boat and Hickory Dickory Dock. We had a mishap today at the library. Show me your head. What happened? He was running out of story time when he wasn't supposed to. And he ran into a wall. And he got that boo-boo on his head. So the library, like, they have this enclosed place where all the kids, like, have story time. And it's, like, a brick wall, like, creating, like, a U-shaped or to, like, enclose kids in. And he ran right into the brick wall and got, like, a huge, so now it's, like, a huge scab. It's bruising. He screamed. And, of course, we're in a library where he's supposed to be quiet. It was a disaster this morning. Thankfully, it's just a scrape. So he's doing okay. But, oh, my gosh. <laughs> That was traumatic for him, but we're doing better now. We're listening to songs on Alexa. I'm feeding him a banana. I'm carrying around his banana for him because if I give it to him, he'll just smash it and smear it on everything. Toddler life. So I'm holding it for him. Sorry, Stark in here. I turned the lights off. So yeah, anyway, I got all of my maternity clothes out and I'm feeling good about that. It's finally starting to get warm. Um, this past weekend, it was cold. It got down to like high 20s, but I think that's as cold as it's going to get. We're in March now, and so the weather should be getting warmer. It's like high of 51 today, but it's raining all day, which of course is when we're going to go grocery shopping. We're going to get poured on. It happened last week too, but that's all right. And um, it looks like it's just going to keep staying like in the 50s. So that's good, bring on the warmer weather. I'm excited to like get out of the house, go back to the parks, you know, go and not just sit around and watch TV and play with the same toys. So I'm excited for spring and summer. Z, 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 yeah, he's saying, the end. One more time, okay. It was way past Thomas's bedtime, but he couldn't sleep. Suddenly, Thomas saw a shooting star. He wanted to see it again. He went to go look for the shooting star. Suddenly, Thomas saw a bright light in the distance. There it is, he peeped. <laughs> the light was not a star. It was Percy's lamp. Owl, have you seen a shooting star, peeped Thomas? No who, no who, said the owl. By now it was way past Thomas's bedtime. He went back to his shed. Suddenly Thomas was fast asleep. Night night, Thomas. The end. The end. Again. Again? Okay. One more time, okay. He is the cutest.